Hello, and welcome back to Stardew Valley. Man, it feels like forever since I have said that phrase. Uh, I think our last episode was on Thursday last week. So, let's see. We are in fall. I've forgotten what I was doing. I remember we built a coop, but I wasn't upgrading the coop. I think it decided to start upgrading the shed. So yes, that is what I've been working on. Upgrading the shed. And... What else? What else have we been up to? I guess we'll see. Let's see. Um, cloudy gusts of wind. Rom, stop it. And it's going to be clear and sunny. Let's see. Queen of Sauce. Here to teach you new mouth-watering recipes. Okay. Uh, tortillas. That was like one of the first recipes we learned. Or at least I feel like it was. Okay. Put away the coffee. It's like taking me a minute to remember how to play this. And Sam gave me pancakes. Okay. Put away the pancakes. Say hello to Lyric. And little Reed. Like, literally, you get nothing from talking to them while they're in their crib like that, but I just, I can't, I can't start the day without saying hello to Reed. Okay, so Lewis gave us a 500 gold check. Looks like I'm doing pretty good on wood. I need more stone, though. I always need more stone. Like, that, that is, that is always the case. Ah, yes, the farm with the fence that doesn't work as a fence. Okay, pet, 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 pet. This coop, I swear, produces the least. Okay, I'll let you guys out, even though there's really no need. Yes, quack, 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 quack. Do, do, do. Say hello to everyone, grab all their eggs. We must have had quite a few feathers yesterday or something, because there's... Or no. No, judging from the six mayo in my inventory, it was actually mayo that we had, or uh, eggs that we had a lot of. How many do we have here now? Okay, so there's six. I kind of want another void chicken. I think the void chickens are really cute. There's just, like, these little black and red d weird chickens. <laughs> okay, let's come over here. Yeah, originally there was a toss-up on what game I'd be playing today, because two of my subscribits decided that they were going to vote for different games, so I had to do a coin toss. And that's how we ended up here. Oh, yeah, huh. We are short a uh, mayonnaise machine. Oops. I guess I need to be making another one of those. Come on. Okay, so all of those are baited. Oh, see, look, we're still doing pretty good on money. Okay, duck, move. They're always in the way, I swear. Okay. Just come grab all of this lovely row. Oh yeah, we need to be making another um another fish pond. Oh. So that's the thing. So I'm going to be trying to m I'm going to move these. So all the ones that are not full at the moment are moving and coming with me. And, of course, my battery's low. Ugh, I swear, this new controller does not hold charge as long as my, uh, my old one did. Okay, and... Let's like, come find those. Doo -doo -doo. So yeah, as the, uh, preserve jars are done, I will be moving them over. Actually, you know what? 
for now, I think I'm actually going to keep them like this. So just move all these guys over here. Because I'm not going to start production with fruit for a while. So fruit's going to be on the other side. Oh my gosh, okay. I'm, I'm used to scrolling over from Minecraft. I'm used to using the controls differently. So that was... Oh, that was confusing. I'll figure it out again. I'll, I'll get used to it again. Okay. It's so weird how even playing just like two days of a different game, like my brain has already started switching over to how the other game plays. I'm like, no, that's that's not this one. That's not how that works. It's like reteaching my brain how to do everything. It is Sunday. We could have Robin start on another uh, another project, but what project to do? I don't know what I want her to start working on, and I did it again. Hmm. What, oh, what shall I do? Also, at this point, I would like to thank my latest subscriber, uh, subscribit. Sorry. Uh, the name is, I'm still trying to get used to saying it out loud. So, my most recent subscribit, Nanabree94. She has joined the ranks of those who have followed me on Twitch, subscribed on YouTube, and joined me on Discord. So, yes. She is now a loyal subscribit and gets all the perks that come with that. Yeah, I'm... <sighs> the last, like, week or so, I've really been trying to figure out how to build and grow a community and make it as interesting as I possibly can, being a rather uninteresting person myself. So I'm like, hmm, how do I... how, how does one... how does one accomplish this? Having no, like, natural charisma. I'm like, I don't, I, I don't know. I'm like, I don't know how to accomplish this. But I am determined to give it the old college try. And so lately, anytime I have downtime, I've been, like, looking at Steam again and trying to figure out what games I really want to get into, what games I feel would stream well, and also, like... Do I want to do only finished games, or should I also try some, like, early access games? And I actually do have several early access games on my wish list, So I keep bouncing back and forth on, hmm, what should I try with this? Should I try this? And for those who are subscribers, we actually are going to... I keep saying... I keep referring to the proverbial we, as in me and those in the community. Um, we will be voting on what game I would be playing when I get my new laptop, which feels like it's going to be another small eternity. But whenever I get that, they will get to vote. So I'm like trying to get enough games that they'll have like a good like kind of back and forth on, ooh, what are we going to vote for? I want to make things as interesting as I possibly can. Um, okay, so we just upgraded that shed. I have another shed up here that's not upgraded yet, but I really don't need that one upgraded at the moment. I could continue to upgrade the coop. It's only on its first upgrade, so... Let's see. Big coop, 400 wood, 150 stone. Which I believe I have. Yeah, I have my new Iridium axe. So I, uh, I have a lot of wood now. I need to get an Iridium pickaxe too. That would be nice. Maybe that's what we should do. Let's... Okay, what is it? 150 stone? 
Okay. Uh, how, ooh, I have... I have enough iridium. So we're actually going to run to see Clint first. I love that I have things to teleport with now. Uh, to town. Hi, Clint. Uh, upgrade tools. Iridium pickaxe. My poor watering can has been so neglected. Okay, yes, we are going for that. Return scepter. One of the most beautiful inventions that ever existed. Yeah, I need to finish... I need to actually upgrade the watering can. I think it's a steel watering can. Which is not good enough. I have so many animals and whatnot, like... This is just gonna make it all the more ridiculous trying to take care of them all, but... Eh. What else am I going to do in this game besides take care of my copious amounts of animals? Okay, hello, Robin. I need to do the community upgrade! Oh, maybe that's what I should do. How much is it? Holy cow! Um... No, thank you. Not at the moment. Jeez, that is so much money! I forgot that it's half a million! Oh boy, okay, never mind. Um, We're gonna go with something slightly less expensive, which is a big coop. Gosh, it's only 10... Why do I remember it only being like 30,000 or 300,000 gold? Jeez, half a million dollars gold for a house for Pam. That's, that's, that is excessive. I don't think, like, okay. I was going to say, I don't think all of my barns together totaled that much, but it probably did. But still, like, the point remains. That is, that is... Do you think that Robin is just, like, price gouging everything? Because chances are I would have to end up buying the uh, lumber from her, so I'm like, oh boy. That's, that's, uh, it's a bit too rich for my blood, just, uh, just saying. I never come up here for, like, the wiggly worms. So there's probably gonna be a bunch of them. Look at that! Three hits! Oops. Okay, there's a- I was like, what is blocking my path? A, a baby tree. Don't look, baby trees! Don't look as I commit this horrible, horrible tree genocide. The culling has to happen. I'm sorry. And this is actually, like, planting trees up here is a trick that I learned from... Oh gosh, I wish... I really, really wish that I actually remembered who it was. Great. Now I'm gonna be like thinking. I'm gonna be thinking over this. What, Rom? Why are you crying? Mia, leave her alone. She doesn't have a tennis ball. Your tennis ball is in Papa's car. We took Mia out to the ranch with us, and we took her tennis ball. Which, I mean, there's more tennis balls in the house, but she's only allowed to have one out at a time. Well. I forgot the tennis ball in the car, so now she's just absolutely losing it because she wants her tennis ball. So I think she's been pestering her sister. I can't really see. Either that or it's the weather. Now, Rob, what are you staring at? Andromeda Isley, what are you staring at? It's a window. There's... It's not snowing. It kind of looks like it's going to snow, but it's not snowing. So I have absolutely no idea, other than the fact that there's a tree somewhat outside the window. So maybe there's like a bird or something. Rum! No, leave it alone, whatever it is. Do you hate it when your pet just doesn't listen to you? Because I'm at that moment. I, I'm really getting perturbed because she does not listen anymore. Rom, knock it off. Why are you so bad? Yes, you. 
Why are you so bad? There's nothing out there. That it, that it goes straight to the backyard. There's nothing back there. Did you see a bird? Okay, we're gonna let... Well, I mean, they're already in. I was gonna say we're gonna let them in, but no, we're just going to shut them in for the night. That way I don't have to deal with pure chaos in the morning. This farm is going to be absolutely packed to the gills with just animals all over the place. And she's still staring at the window. Do you ever have that feeling like when your pet's just staring off into like nothingness that you're just like, uh, what you doing? Like, I have that feeling right now, but I like, I don't want to focus on her. So I'm just like, I, uh, like, I don't know what you're doing, child. I don't think she knows what she's doing, to be honest, but. Okay. Let's come sell all of these. Okay, I put everything away. So we have over a stack of wool. Oh my gosh, why do I... I have way too much sap. Um, can I make any more useful things? I can make some more kegs. I need to make more... I need to make more bars. I need more bars of everything. Do, do, do. Maybe that's... Maybe I do need to upgrade this shed so that I can put just like a huge row of furnaces. But that would take a lot of stone, which I would probably have to buy from Robin, which I don't feel like buying anything from Robin right now. I think I'm just still salty about the, the whole half a million. Like, goodness. That is a lot. And it's been a while since I've done any fishing, so... Something tells me the luck is not good today, and I feel like I forgot to check what the luck was. I guess we'll see. I actually need to be working on catching more fish because I have not caught all the fish. What the heck? Yeah, stop it. These dogs, I swear, they are they are my problem children. Okay, well, that's just a lot of trash. Like, quite literally. Okay, get rid of that. And I'll go put the other trash in here. Man, that process is quick. Do, 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 do. What do I got? 12? Eh, not bad. I really wish that... I don't know. I, I don't know what I want. Do I want like more efficiency or I'm I'm lost as to what I'm like. Have I just done this for too long? <laughs> like I need I need something. Just a little uh a little on the dull side right now. Rom, leave it. I have absolutely no idea what she's going on about. She's she's been very very poorly behaved lately, and I'm I'm quite perturbed with her. Yeah, stop groaning, child. Okay, well everyone's asleep, and so too shall I. That tune is like so soothing. I love that. I love the addition of the jukebox. That way you can play music. Okay. I think I also forgot to check the uh, the calendar. So I just might have missed somebody's birthday. Please tell me I didn't. Okay, I did not. I really wish there was a marker or something for the birthdays. Because Lyric was born on the 26th. But there's no, there's no marker for her birthday or anything. Also... We totally had our anniversary and, like, nothing happened. Our anniversary was the 18th of summer? 
a little disappointed in that. And like our birthday. We don't have a birthday. I feel like that's something that we should have like been allowed to pick in the beginning. Let's see. It's going to rain all day tomorrow and be sunny and beautiful on the island. The spirits are in good humor today. Oh, it's blackberry season! Oh my gosh, I have so many- Oh, okay. Okay, um... Winter's just around- it, Winter is not just around the corner. We're on day eight of fall. Uh, we need to double check the heating system, turn off the valves, and check all the insulation in the house. Sam, it's the eighth of fall. Did I? Don't worry, I'll take care of it all. Okay. I was like, did I kiss Sam? No, no I didn't. Almost committed a, a heinous crime. Did not kiss my husband before I left the house. Okay, say hi to Lyric and baby Reed is sleeping. Okay. What do we got? Say hello to Lucia because she's over here. I always end up with so much iridium because I never bother to process it because I'm I feel like I don't actually use it that much I feel like I'm always using like gold and iron and copper I feel like those are always like what I'm using instead okay there's that okay I'm going to move this cloth over to the empty spot that way I don't end up having to go back and forth and back and forth refilling that spot. Okay. Let's see. I also want to give a shout out to another one of my subscribers, uh, Lady Octopus. She, she made a clip from my Minecraft episode yesterday and it was hilarious. I want to say she titled it Absolute Malarkey because so many bad things happened one right after the other. So I accidentally killed a wolf. Um, I was given poor advice. So yes, I accidentally killed a wolf. And then right after that, while I was mourning the loss of the wolf, I had a zombie start attacking me. And then right after the zombie <laughs> finished attacking me, I got attacked by a skeleton. And then after I killed the skeleton, I was blown up by a creeper <laughs> and knocked back into the pit and I died and I had to respawn and get all my stuff and I was very angry. I just grabbed the wrong journal. I was like, why is this, uh, like, why does this look different? Because that's my phasmophobia journal. I'm weird. When I game, I have so many different, like, I have notebooks for different games so that I can write down, like... For Sims, I have, like, tips and tricks written down. For uh, Stardew Valley, I have all the animal names written down. I have so many things. Hello! I'm trying to find where I've written down my names for these animals. Because they are in alphabetical order. Okay. We need a name that begins with a D. And we have already had Denise, Dora, and Dolly. So we shall have... Um... Destiny. And Destiny is a chicken. What kind of chicken? I have absolutely no idea because this game likes to throw curveballs. You put a white egg in, it gives you a brown chicken. That's I think that's actually what happened to us last time. Okay. There we go. Okay. Now we have a little chicken. Oh, it's okay. It's a white chicken. So it evened out. I always like to have an even amount of my chickens. So the last one we had was a brown one. And now we have another little white chick. So there we go. Um, I'm actually just going to keep that egg on me. And I need a memo to me. Make another mayonnaise machine. Do do do. So Robin should be upgrading that coop, which means, yay, more animals! 
which means plenty more people are going to think I'm absolutely insane, but you know what? It's, it, it is what it is. How else am I supposed to make money? You know, it's not purely about the capitalism, though, because I actually genuinely do love my animals. Okay, let's see. So I was going to leave those here. Move you over. This is so... It's so weird having to, like, move things. Because everything's just all... It's, it, everything's all cattywampus, I swear. Okay. Eh, grab that. You know, I'm actually going to finish this one first. There's always that one bot. I don't know why. And I, like, I really wish I knew what made the bot show up, or is it a person posting? But honestly, it's, it's a little annoying. Oh boy. Okay. We also need more preserved jars. Like, I didn't already know that. So now we're just going to have to sell the row as is. There's so many different machines that I, I need, but I just keep forgetting that I actually do need them. Okay, move, move everything over. Ooh, and it looks like we have cranberries ready. This is going to be fun. Okay, just run through the cranberry field. Which, I mean, it, this is not how cranberries grow, I believe. Do I know exactly how they're grown? No, not entirely, but I, I still feel like this is wrong. I think there's, what, a cranberry bog or something like that? I feel like more water should be involved in this. Okay. So this is going to be interesting. I want to see how much gold we get from the cranberries. Ugh, more cows! <laughs> so many cows! Although I do find it interesting when you look at the different varieties of animals, there are way more, like, chickens. Because there's two colors of cows, and then other than that, I don't think there's any more duplicates. For chickens, you have white chickens, you have brown chickens, you have blue chickens, you have void chickens, and then there is a hidden fourth, fifth, fifth, yeah, fifth type of chicken. Which cannot be unlocked until, like, the very, very end of the game. So, seriously, why are there five different types of chickens and only, like... I, I feel like the, um... I feel like the barn animals kind of got the uh, short end of the stick on variety, but... I can't really complain too much. I love all the animals equally, so... Ugh, it's just a pain in the butt trying to take care of them every single day. Especially since I have so many. But I love them, which is why I, I feel horribly guilty if I cannot pet them all. Must pet. Must pet all of the animals. No, stop trying to drink everything. Ugh. So what shall we do today? I don't... I don't have a pickaxe. So there's, like, no mining opportunity there. I could go to the island. I actually probably should. I haven't checked on the, um... On all the goods and stuff there in a while. I probably have things growing, like, out the wazoo that I just haven't found yet, so... Uh, the fruit that I never do anything with. The useless fruit. Although, once I finally get the, uh, that shed fully equipped with a billion and one preserve jars, I hopefully should actually be doing stuff with that fruit. Okay. Everything just takes forever. So much walking, so much processing, so much planning. Okay, now I gotta sell all this stuff. Sell, 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 and there we go. How many mussels do I have? I do not have enough to buy another tree. <sighs> Takes forever, like honestly. Saving up to buy some of these things just... It's a, it's a little heavy in the old time department. Okay, so grab everything. 
I'm so glad I have the return scepter though, because now I don't have to worry about, oh no, I stayed too long on the island, whatever shall I do? I can just zip home whenever I want to. The problem is getting there though. That is the unfortunate part. And I'm not gonna bother taking any food, because like I said, I really probably shouldn't be going into the mines without a pickaxe. Because I would get stuck. And that is the last thing I need. Okay. Hi, Willie. What are you doing? Have you had much luck? <laughs> no, I am awful at fishing. You should know it based on the lack of fish that I sell. Okay. Also, I need to be building friendships. Like, that is... Uh, that is the one... That is the probably easiest thing I could do to get my perfection up is just make friends with everyone. It's not extremely hard. It's a little bit difficult. Who's here? Oh, Sam! Check out these gnarly waves. Guess what? I'm gonna save up for a surfboard. Sam! Um, darling, love of my life. Where are our children? Uh, Sebastian's hanging out by the tree. Oh wow, there's a lot of people here. Leo, Pam... Hi, everything okay? Oh, hi Leo, you're so cute. Willie really gives each a piece of his fish jerky on the ride over. Delicious. Why does Pam like fishing so much? I'm honestly curious. An island this big has got to be hiding some buried treasure. Abigail, leave it alone, that's my hidden treasure. Like, the only people who should be exploring this island are me and Leo. Uh, just some weeds. Oh, yeah, huh. I planted all these sprinklers, but I have no crops for them yet. Just... Huh. Okay, well. Did I... I never finished that... Dang it. Uh, I... Okay, so I missed out on that one. Let's see. Because Mr. Chi will give you quests, but like I said, I, I forgot to finish that one. And that was probably one of the easiest ones. Dang it. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. What? What is this? Uh, so, cheese hungry challenge. I have to make it to level 100 in the Skull Cavern, but I can't eat or drink anything. So that means if I start getting hit, then I'm, you know, I'm as good as dead. And then four prismatic shards. I, I don't have that many. That's, that is unfair, sir. Uh, and I have zero of these gems because I haven't been able to finish any of his tasks. And look at that, 47%. That's actually slightly higher than when I checked last time. I think it was at 43 last time. I have... Okay, so fish, I'm actually not doing too bad. 85%. It's the crafting and cooking that's really bringing me down. Also, star drop. I, th I, th I should only be missing one. But I have to complete... What do I need? I need the bone flute. I don't know where to find that. And then I have I'm missing several several stones. Hmm. So yeah, I'm I'm missing a couple things to get um the museum finished. I'm working on it slowly, very slowly but surely. Uh we can take out these guys. Come on. I need to take out the slimes anyway for the uh, monster slayer goal. Do these guys count? I mean, they should. They there are slimes. <gasps> Hello. That is okay. I completely understand the feeling. Most of the time when I'm late for a stream, it's because I have been distracted by something. Today though, I had to do I had to do my dishes and whatnot, so I wasn't distracted today, but for the most part, <laughs> I'll get distracted like riding something. I'm like, oh, that's such a good idea, I need to write that down, and then all of a sudden I'm like, oh crud, I'm late for my live stream. Yeah, it it happens. 
Okay, let's see. We might as well just go home, because I can't go to the mine. Which, I mean, I would have liked to go to the volcano mine, because I still need... I am still missing the... Uh, I need two of the dragon's teeth. Ah! I have three prismatic shards. Three. How lame. I needed four, but also I don't feel like getting rid of four of them. That's just uh, not my idea of a good time. Hmm. There's like nothing much to do. Could let these guys in. And tuck them in for the night. Good night, my little chickens and ducks and dinosaurs and rabbits. I have way too many animals. Which, yes, I'm probably going to complain every single time I go over here. But just remember, I love them. Not everyone would be crazy enough to have... Oh gosh, how many do I have now? I have... 26 times 3... Can I do mental math? 26 times 3... 18... Carry the 1, 6, 7, 70... 8, 9, 81, 82, 83 animals? Did I actually do that math right? Is it... Okay, okay. Hang on. I gotta, I gotta check the math real quick. Let us see. We have 26 times 3 plus... Wait, what? 26 times 3 plus 4. 82. I can't remember if that's the number that I said, but it sounds right. 88. Huh. I was... <laughs> if I didn't get a spot on, I was close enough. Okay, we need... We need mayo machine. <laughs> I'm my whole job is mostly doing mental math, so every time I try to do it on here, I'm like, my brain is so strained because I've been doing math all day. I'm like, could it be right? Possibly. Is it right? I have no idea. Okay, let's go put this down here. Do -do -do. Math is that thing with the numbers that hurts your brain. Although if you have the fancy math, it's got letters in it too. Okay, well, Allie needs to get out of my way. Move, chicken! What? Brenda, you two? Come on, chickens. Help me out. Help the farmer out. G back up. Do something. No, not I'm not talking to you, Brenda. Oh my gosh. Why are they like this? Okay, I'm just gonna throw this right here. I don't want it there, but I'll have to move it back. Or I'll have to move it tomorrow when they're out of the way. <laughs> Seriously! Lucia is always in the way. She's always blocking me from getting into my bed. And then all of a sudden, the chickens want to join in. And now the preserve jars don't want to go where they're supposed to be. Okay, there we go. That's going to bug me until I get everything moved off into the right order. Slowly but surely, I am getting this farm set to rights. Okay. Where is Sam? There he is! Speak of the devil. What? It's dark in here, Sam. Seeing family is nice, but it's also kind of depressing in a weird way. Like, our lives are totally- Okay, Sam. Sam. It's always gonna happen. You grow up, you grow older, things change, but... It's kind of nice, though, having your own separate lives. Let's see. Most of this was... For, uh... Okay, so we made decent money off the cranberries. So, about, what, seven? A little, a little under seven grand, so, eh. 
Not bad. I, the pigs, though. The pigs will always make the most money. Okay, so today is the last day on this episode. I was like, what? Uh, how many days have we been in here? Okay, so we've already said hello to Lyric. It's going to be clear and sunny and clear and sunny tomorrow. Please be good. Eh, they're in good humor. It's not great, but it's not bad. Cactus fruit for Sam. Do you think- See, I told you. Sam ships them together. Do you think Sebastian and Abigail will ever hook up? I hope so. Now that I'm married, I'm trying to get everyone else married too. Okay, so if we're talking about ships here, uh, Abigail and Sebastian, obviously. Alex and Haley, they're always together. Would not be a far leap. Mm. I think that's like it, really, because I don't. Uh, Mar Maru and Harvey, I think they would be really cute together. Dear Anastasia, one week from today, we are holding the Stardew Valley Fair in the town square. It's the biggest event of the year, drawing people from across, from all across the country. Uh, to our humble town. If you'd like, we can set up a green display for the event. Or, you can set up a green display. Uh, just bring up to nine items that best showcase your talents, which I'm probably going to forget until the day before, so I'm going to be scrounging through all of the things that I have to figure out what would be best. You'll be judged on the quality and diversity of your display. The fair starts at 9 a.m. Don't miss it. Mayor Lewis. Okay, Lewis. I got it, I got it. Gotta make the town look good. Although, how do I happen to own enough property that, like, my property is probably about the size of the town map. Like, that's, that's a lot of property for one person. I'm, su I'm really surprised that Lewis didn't try to, like, split it up or anything. Okay, and all of you guys get to stay inside because it's raining. You guys won't go outside anyway. Do, 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 do. Quack, 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 quack. Quack, 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 quack. Okay, there we go. I love the ducks. I just think they're absolutely adorable. A part of me actually wants to learn cross stitch. That way I can get the, uh, the booklet. Somebody made a booklet on, like, cross-stitch patterns of, like, the characters and animals and stuff. And part of me really, really wants that. But I have no idea how to cross-stitch. I think, though, that, like, the ducks and the blue chickens. I love the blue chickens' little curly tails. I don't, they're just absolutely adorable. Okay, now I can move that back so long as none of these chickens get in the way. Go back that way. Grab that. Move it on down. There we go. There we go. That's nice. That is very nice. Now we are in proper order. Although I should have made two because now that this chicken just hatched, like I'm going to need another one. Why did I not think of this? <laughs> Why did I not think things through? Ooh, so that one's almost fully upgraded. Although it's Tuesday. I can't stop by Robin's on Tuesday because she's not open on Tuesday. <sighs> Robin and I, I have a bone to pick with that woman. Her and Marnie. I feel like those two are always gone when I need them the most. Ooh, berries. I forgot that it was berry season. Uh, every day more. Oh, I can do that. I can do that. It's totally fine. Ooh. I'll move you guys over. <laughs> We're getting organized! It makes me so happy. Okay. And grab that. Ooh, there's one more. Sweet! So we can get everything in the line. Love me some good straight lines. Sweet. Okay, now time to just put everything in here. 
do do do. No, don't eat that. Don't eat that. Look at that! We actually had enough! Cue Anna singing for the first time in forever. I swear, I that's what, <laughs> that's what I sing in my head whenever I'm like, Man, it's been so long! It's like for the first time! Yeah. Yes, Disney songs go through my head. I don't even remember... Was it 2014 that Frozen came out? So how long ago was that? 2014 was seven years ago? Wow. That's... It's so weird to put things in perspective on how old things are. Just... Ugh. I feel old, even though I'm not old. But I feel it. What were we talking about? We were talking about when the first iPhone came out. And I was like, I was thinking about it because my boss was just asking us these random, like, when was this invented? And I was like, 2007. I was like, that sounds right. And sure enough, I'm like, 2007. I remember, like, before iPhones and before smartphones were a thing. I'm like, oh my gosh, I feel so old. What are. Every now and then, I'll tell my husband, like, back in my day, like, back in my day, phones still had buttons. <laughs> uh, it's so fun, because he's only three years older than me. So, it's, it's funny when we start saying, like, back in my day, I'm like, we're not even that old, but we feel it. I think that's like the trademark of my generation. Uh, we're not old yet, but we feel it. Uh, I was gonna say, eh, I don't need to talk to the pigs. I do. The pigs still need pets, even though they don't produce anything. In the rain. Which makes them... Pigs are slightly useless, because they don't produce anything in winter or when it rains. I think you just have to kind of think, does the ridiculous amount of money that they bring in when it's, you know, when they actually do bring in money. Is it worth having to, like, feed them and whatnot during the winter without any payoff? I feel... I don't know. I, f I feel like I want to say yes, but I'm, I can't quite commit to that answer. Do, do, do. Um, yeah, just sell these. I don't want to keep the berries. I have absolutely no reason to keep the berries, but I feel like I want to. For reasons unknown to me. And I like how the... I love how the beach farm actually does have, like, bushes and stuff. So you can harvest those. And it also has, um, like, forageable items. Which makes this map kind of useful. I'm not going to say it's the best map, because it's not, but it's not bad. Okay, grab the jade. It's Tuesday. What can I do on a rainy Tuesday? I can't really buy anything. Uh, I could go pick up my pickaxe and then... No, not six. I think I'm gonna upgrade the watering can. That sounds like a good option. It's, it's a balanced option. Also, I have nothing else to do. That was the laziest thing I think I've ever done. I literally just teleported back and I was super close. Okay, I have these geodes that I should probably crack open. I want to see if I can get the remainder of those things that I'm missing for the museum. So I might as well take them with me now. Hi Pam! They need to make like an awning or something for Pam. I just, I feel bad for her. She just stands in the rain just waiting to take me to my destination. Okay, yes I have an Iridium pickaxe. Is he like Robin? You can't talk to him after... Wait, no. Yes? Yes, that's, that goes there. 
was like, wait a second. Okay, if he is like Robin, I'm going to process these geodes first. Because if you task Robin with making something for you, you can't talk to her again after that. She's like, I have a task and that is all I can do. I better get something good because I could be using these Omni Geodes to get more of the um, artifact troves. I'm getting decent stuff. Except for that, um, the, the clay. Dolomite. I actually want to look up some of these gems and stuff and see if they're like real things and what they look like. I used to love rocks when I was a kid, and some of the things I'm like, I wonder, I wonder if, I wonder if some of the things I see in video games are actually real, and I've just never seen them in real life. Yeah, I'm like, I know a couple of them. Like, I mean, obviously, like, marble, granite, uh, slate, soapstone. Yeah, I'm like, I know some of them are real. Like, pyrite. I'm like, I don't know about some of these things. Please let something be new here. I'm just gonna have to, like, sell these. Because <laughs> right now all they're doing is taking up inventory space. Huh. Lemon stone. I'm curious as to what that looks like. Limestone is a thing. Fairy stone just sounds pretty. So does ghost crystal. Oh my gosh. Look at look at all the inventory space that has been taken up. Okay, so now I get to check and see if any of these can be donated. No, no. <gasps> Ooh! One! Okay, yeah, one. Oro Verde Quartz. Lemon Quartz. I feel like I've seen that. I feel like, I, I feel like I've heard of that before. Okay, so we need to sell... Pretty much all of this, but the Ocean Stone. Uh, I, have, I have so many Frozen Tears. Okay, well, there's that. Now process the rest of them. I just need one. I need one artifact, please? No, not that. I don't want a treasure chest. <laughs> All I want is a bone flute. Where do I get those? Ancient drum. All this is just stuff that I don't need. Interesting. You should find a picture online and post it to the Discord server so I can see what it looks like. Okay, a mahogany seed is literally probably the most useless thing that I have gotten. Really? Banana sapling. We like that. See, the banana sapling was at least useful. And very hard to come by, I might say. <sighs> One more thing. I got a reward. Watch it be equally useless. Magic rock candy. Actually, that's not too shabby. You just go home. Just go put all this... Put all the garbage away. Seriously, what was that? Like, I hardly got anything useful. I also forgot to upgrade my watering can. The whole point of going there. Run, tiny legs! I need to get there before four. He closes at four. Come on, come on, come on. I swear, the return scepter is going to get me in trouble one of these days. 
Ink, upgrade, gold water again. Yeah, there we go. Okay, now we can teleport back home. Sell all of this useless garbage. Like, seriously, who needs... Who needs another gold relic? Or an arrowhead? I think those sell... I think the treasure chests sell for, like, 5,000 gold. Okay. For now, this sapling is going to go in here. I actually kind of want to see something. Give me... Give me this. We're, we're going to test what the uh, gold relic makes when you sew it into clothing. That is one thing I have not experimented with nearly enough is the tailoring system. Okay, cloth and gold relic. It's nice that it'll show you if you've already made it. That way you avoid making the same thing twice. What do we get? What do we get? Relic shirt. I found a gold relic and I've got the shirt to prove it. Okay, well, that's kind of dumb. Regret that choice a little bit. I'm just gonna. Oh my gosh. Okay, well. Um, what else are we up to? I really don't have anything to do, really, so. Uh, let's go to the Adventurer's Guild and see where we're, see where we're at with our goals. Hmm. See, I, it's like, why take the name? Like, why not actually find a, an actual cool rock? Like, you know, I like rose quartz. I think it's actually very beautiful. Uh, oh, look at that! We're so close to the slime goal! We're only short... What is that? 72? Like, so close! Void spirits? We still need eight of those. Maybe I should just go to, like, the lower levels in the mine. You know what? That's gonna be the plan. Because the void spirits, I think, are in, like, the 80s? Like, the 70s or the 80s? So let's go down there. Let's uh let's take a gander and see what happens. Um let's try set that's still ice. I don't I don't wanna be there. 80? Okay, well, there we go. Do 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 based off of like what the what a faceted one would look like because you literally like have just well no okay I changed my mind you actually can do that because Clint has technically processed at least part of it so it would make sense that it would be a faceted one yes they can be very very different why? Why would you give me these levels? I hate these levels. These red skulls are just the worst. And watch, there's probably a bunch of them. I see another one floating. Yeah, oh, oh, oh. Go away. Go away. Come on. Any more? No. So now we just have to mine further down. I don't know why these levels, like, randomly pop up. I feel like before the 1.5 update, I never had them pop up like that. And now all of a sudden, they're just popping up left, right, and sideways. More slimes! There's an emerald there, too. Now I have to kill pretty much any slime I come across, because I'm like, I need it! I need you for the goal! Also, those chests and stuff rarely have anything for me. I feel cheated. I feel cheated of the experience of the energy. Uh, no, no, no. Ooh, 
more slimes. Come on. Okay, how tall are these stones? Why can I not hit a slime over a stone? Would that just be cheating? Is that why they're like, eh, you have to you have to work harder for what you want? Okay, there's no other enemies. <sighs> Which means I just have to sit here and plow away. There we go. Knock knock, anyone home? Um, that does make sense. Ooh, more sand. Void spirit. Those guys are hard, the shadow brutes. And I feel kind of bad because they're the same thing as Krobus. Like, they they could be family. I'm like, I'm, I'm so sorry, Krobus. I don't mean to. I actually saw somebody who was playing Stardew Valley and they purposely tried to get through the mines without killing anything. Because their thing was... They're like, oh, these, these, you know, these creatures and beings live down in the mines. Like, you're encroaching on their territory. I'm like, now I feel bad. Now I think that, you know, I'm the intruder, so... I'm like, dang it. I hate it when video games make me feel bad. <laughs> there are so many games that I, like, I hate making choices. Especially when it's like, they're just the... The lesser of the evils. I'm like, why would you do that to me? And then people are like, it's just a video game. I'm like, it doesn't stop the hurt in my heart that I had to decide this. <gasps> Ooh, Monster Slayer goal. Y seriously, and um, who is it? Mayor Lewis will request that you get rid of some of the slimes. Um, there are several people who will request that you slay a certain amount of um, creatures. I'm like, but why? Like, there's no reason. Okay, I think the Adventurer's Guild closed. I think they close at 10. So there's no point in trying to go see them. But I will put this stuff away. I got a ring. What, what kind of ring are you? What are this? Just, I love how I just throw everything haphazardly into into all of these chests. Okay, it's a ruby ring. Do I have need of a ruby ring? No, I do not. Because I have iridium bands. Who needs anything else when you have iridium bands? Yeah. Yeah, the shadow people. I'm like, I, I feel bad, but the, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to do about that. It's part of the game mechanic. <laughs> it just makes it, there's no option to make peace. I would make peace if it was an option. Also, I did give you a shout out earlier for making that clip. <laughs> I laughed so hard. So when I went on to upload... When I went on to upload the video, I was just laughing because I saw that clip and I was like, I wonder. So I pulled it up on my phone <laughs> and it's just me one wrong thing after another happening. But that was the last day on this episode. Why do I always get a phone call? I'm going to answer it just so that I can do my outro. Jeez. Oh, it's Vincent. Aww. <laughs> Do you have any piggies on your farm? Yes, I have 12 of them. Okay, I gotta go. Oh, how sweet. We got a call from our little brother-in-law. Okay, but now I can do the outro. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much to all of my subscribers who have been voting on things and kind of helping me get a feel for, you know, our new community. I just wanted to say you guys are awesome. Um, just thank you for voting on the, the episodes and, you know, on anything I throw your way. Uh, if you guys would be interested in becoming a subscribent, feel free to, 
uh, follow me on Twitter, or not Twitter, Twitch. There's too many different social medias. Follow me on Twitch, subscribe on YouTube, and join me on my Discord channel. And you will be able to take place in um, special voting opportunities. So there's some customization aspects. There's all sorts of stuff that we're working towards. But once again, thank you so much for joining me. Uh, I will be back tomorrow with another episode voted f on by my Discord channel. So feel free to join there if you want to pick my game for tomorrow. But until then, bye!